I don't know about you friends, but I could use a super simple project. So let's make one. We're going to make a candle for Valentine's Day. Hey, everybody, it's Colette with Blessings Craft Therapy, if you didn't know. And if you did, thank you so much for coming back. All right, so we're going to start with this LED candle from Dollar Tree. And you're going to take the wrapper off. Easy peasy. There it is. Now we're going to start with a little bit of Mod Podge, just a small layer. And I'm just doing a strip of it. Then I have this tissue paper from Dollar Tree, and I'm going to put the candle on it, on that strip, right? We're going to smooth it out, make sure we get all our wrinkles out. Now I'm putting some Mod Podge on the side on my paper only because it gives me some more control as to how much I put on. And then I'm gonna do another strip just to make sure again that it's nice and thin. We don't wanna go overboard. I made sure that that edge was down. Now we're gonna do another strip of Mod Podge, nice and thin. And I'm going to pull my tissue paper taut so we can get some of those wrinkles out. And I'm just gonna keep going around the whole candle doing it like that. So, you know, little strip, pull it taut, get the wrinkles out and move on. You could do the whole thing with Mod Podge right off the bat, but I have found that I get way more wrinkles doing that, so I don't. So this is just how I do it. And to be clear, I still messed it up. <laughs> but I'm here to tell you, it's okay if you mess things up because this candle has a front and a back now. <laughs> so this is where I messed it up. I cut the excess off um, I probably should have cut the excess off before I even started, but that is neither here nor there. <laughs> so I cut the excess off. I made sure to um, rub all of the wrinkles out. And you'll see here, see that top part? Oh, I snipped it too close, and then I had like a triangle piece missing. Whatever. I, listen, it's okay. It'll be like our Christmas tree, right? Where the, you know, party in the front, mess in the back. <laughs> Anyways, I sanded off the edge on both the top and the bottom. I'm using a sandy block, sanding block from Dollar Tree, but you could use a sanding paper. You could use an emery board. Just take your time and go lightly. Only because right now the Mod Podge isn't dry. And if you go too rough too fast, it might tear it and pull it off of your candle. So just be word to the wise. Um, and no, I did not put a top coat on. You certainly could if you wanted. I did not. But look at how pretty that is right there. Oh, you can stop right there, right? Look, at we'll turn it on. It's so pretty. Look how pretty that is. I love it. And it could be for every day, right? But you know, I can't stop there. We're going to add a little jute. I just wrapped it around the candle a few times. And then we're going to just tie it in a simple bow. I'm not even going to glue it. I'm not going to add a button. Nothing crazy, right? Just because we're going for easy tonight. Easy also because I'm not fixing my mistake. I could have redone the whole thing, but I'm like, no, I have children that are not feeling well and I'm tapped. So we need it easy. And look at how pretty this is. Stop it. Like super easy, super cute. And I dare say we could have this out all year long. I mean, hearts, we love all year, right? It's fine. But look at it at night. Are you kidding? Wait, wait for this one. <gasps> look at it at night. It looks so pretty. I love it so much. Oh. Anyways, I know. Calm down. It's just a candle. But I love it. And it was easy. And it made me happy. And you can't even see where I screwed it up. It's all smoke and mirrors tonight. <laughs> Anyways, friends, thank you so much for watching. And I hope this inspires you. Mm -hmm.